in Taiwan by a number this week. We're going to be talking about our furry friends or pets in Taiwan. Now, you guys know that pets have been increasing at a rate of 10% lately. Past Every couple year? years. Past couple of years. Wow, wow, okay. Whereas the birth rate has been declining by about 4%. Mm. So, so people are having dogs, not kids. Yes. <laughs> so my question for you is... When is the number of pets going to outnumber the number of kids 15 and younger? What year? What year? For that mm -hmm. year? Yeah. That, oh when, when do the pets outnumber the kids? You mean it hasn't kids? already happened? <laughs> 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 um, oh, goodness. I'm going to say 2,023. Okay. I'm going to go 2,022. All right. The okay. price of right. <laughs> <laughs> so before we uh, take a look at the answer, let's take a look at this video. This is Niu Niu, a police dog whose job is to patrol a neighborhood in the southern city of Tainan. Niu Niu does a pretty good job, but she not only helps the police, she also enjoys playing with children. Tainan's vocational pet training center trains stray dogs like Niu Niu. Holding up two fingers like this means bark twice. Once they are trained, they can become campus dogs or god dogs, depending on their personality. Dog trainer Huang Lianfa said it takes half a month for strays to learn simple commands. The dog is learning to sit on command. It's a win-win situation for all. Training stray dogs also relieves overcrowding in animal shelters because well-trained dogs are in demand. That's such a great video. You know... <laughs> You know what they call it when dogs learn how to do a job? <laughs> On the dog training. <laughs> sorry. Throw me a bone here. <laughs> throw me a bone. Woof, woof. All right. Sorry. Okay. I had to say that. Okay. So I had a question for you guys. When are our pets going to outnumber our children in Taiwan? And you said 2023? 2022. 2023 yes. and 2022. Let's take a look at the answer. It's next year. What? Wait, what? Yeah, the end of next year. The latter half of next year. Wow. So that's, the, the pets are growing really that's quickly. That's a big aren't concern. They? I'm going to move all my money out of baby formula and protect <laughs> <laughs> pet food. That's a good okay, investment. Okay, so yeah. we should learn more about our cats and dogs, right? Yes. And we just had a video about stray dogs. So let me ask you the government actually has an estimate of how many stray dogs are in Taiwan. What was their estimate for last year? Stray dogs in Taiwan mm -hmm. last year. I think you need to go first, Leslie. Um, <laughs> Take a wild guess. <laughs> stray dogs, like 250,000? Okay. I'm going to say, oof, that's a good guess. 250,000. Okay, 249,999. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's take a look at the answer. Yes, 146. I win. You're closer. 146,773. That's They're very good. specific, right? Yeah, it's very specific. <laughs> How do they get that kind of a specific guess? I don't guess? know. They do it by, by county, and okay. somehow they came to that number. Excellent. Okay. Yeah. So they're, they're keeping track. Mm -hmm. All right. So another question is, you know, people acquire their pets in many ways. For dogs, they might adopt one from the shelter or take in a stray dog or um, it may be a gift or it could be purchase. So how many of the pet dogs have been taken in as stray dogs from the street? How many, mm -hmm. of, what percentage? Straight from the street? Yes. Oh, So wow. what percentage of the pet dogs have been taken straight from the street? There are pretty big campaigns for like rescuing dogs now. I but usually say... they go through like, like shelters and stuff, no? Does that but then that sense? means adopting. Mm. Oh, it does, okay. Yeah. Um, hmm. You go first. 67%. Wow. wow. <laughs> I like that That's very optimistic. <laughs> well, I'm I got it wrong. Say 38.5%. <laughs> okay, let's take a look at the answer. 22%. That's it. Yeah. Okay. So, so we need actually, to work better on that. Yeah, actually, number one is um, adoption, 32%. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then number two is purchasing at 23%. So actually, a lot of them, um, adoption, I think, are also mm. mostly stray dogs as well. That's good. So if so we actually, add that to the 22%, then right, a lot of them Right. It's over 50. Are, yeah. Over half, actually, were originally stray dogs. Mm. Less than half are bought. Okay. But only 23% are bought, and the rest are gifts or the, your own dog's dogs. Yeah. <laughs> right, right, right. <laughs> that is the thing, too. 
Okay, so one more question. Okay. Now, this is about the pet industry. It's, it's booming, right? Mm. All these pets. So how much uh, money do the Taiwanese spend per year in NT dollars on their pets? Collectively. <coughs> Collectively. Per oh, year. Wow. Give us a wild NT dollar wow. figure. I always get these wrong. Millions. Oh, uh, I'm going to say... I'm going to say, uh, if everybody had a dog, 23 million people, <laughs> and spend a dollar a year. I'm going to say 23 million. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Pet maintenance, I think, is a little more, more than that. I'm going to say 50 million. 50 million anti dollars? Okay, let's take a look at the answer. 50, 50 billion. billion. Yeah, what? they spend a lot more than that. Wait. Now, they don't have health insurance. They spend the most on food and then on medical care and then they need clothes and accessories. So that's like nearly Grooming? two billion US dollars. Like a hundred Nearly and... about one point six billion US dollars. Wow. That's a lot. I went the total wrong direction with that. Wow. So we they're actually did. expensive, not as expensive as kids are, but, uh, mm. but yes. they're easier to take care of than kids. Yes. Right? And people are going that way. So kids anyway. don't take tests. You don't have to like send them to like cram <laughs> school, right? <laughs> I mean, kids do. Pets, pets don't, right? <laughs> thank heavens there are no <laughs> cram schools for pets. Well, thank you so much. Uh, sure. That is today's Taiwan by Number.